People want to know, they talk about the indigo children. Why do these kids seem so, you know, super aware and all that? It's because they're growing up in an environment where there's no media kicking them in the head. Hmm. There's no railroads, there's no huge there's cities with pollution like the 19th century. There's no movies and big radio drums, tribal drums of radio or hmm. TV blasting. They get it all in a little invisible thing on their iPhone. Hmm. And, they get, and they get to pick and choose. Even with that autonomy, um, there seems to be still such uniformity. That's the uniformity of the industrial uh, homogenization of the chemical body yes and then the industrial uh, analog media which i call the tv body yes but they know that the chip body is what they live in and what they're good at but every generation and novelists have pointed this out through the years every generation is always fascinated with the generation just before them they are fascinated with their parents well what was going on with them so they're fascinated by the analog media phase right 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 Absolutely. That's their, their parents, media parents, is the whole, all the media before uh, the satellite. But Bob, what, what, always, what always confounded me in trying to get straight um, uh, with your uh, cosmology of all of this is that the chip is composed of that old media. So they are seeing um, digitized analog videos. Everything that used to be of the... Uh, of this old architecture is in the chip, and doesn't it still um, bring the very same um, confining and conformist energies, even though it's being delivered um, in uh, in something that's so accessible? Just like speech was a conforming medium, you get a tribe speaking the same language. That's totalitarian. Right. Each individual citizen or entity in the tribe, the primitive tribe, is not allowed to blather their own syllables (laughs) see so it begins media forms a meme and the first one was speech now now here's a law that McLuhan came up with every culture on the broad level is fascinated by the previous phase so what were the alphabetic Greeks time of Plato and Aristotle and Socrates you know 400 BC what were they what became the content of their culture it was Homer and that whole pre-alphabetic stuff then you come to you come 400 years later, you come to Rome. What are they obsessed with in the content of their writings and novels and culture? They're obsessed with Greece and the great Greek philosophers and philosophical debates. So then you get the Dark Ages, so that wipes out the books for a little bit. But then you get uh, Charlemagne and the Holy Roman Empire retrieved 800 to 1000 AD or ACE. Mm-hmm. The point is, is what is Charlemagne trying to uh, rebuild? Rome! We walk backwards into the future. We're always got our, our cultural gaze, our meme gaze on the last amazing environment, a different kind of environment, because what's happening in Europe in the uh, around 1,000 years ago is way different from Rome, 1,000 years before that, but in the imagination of the collective, they are thinking in rearview mirror terms and they see Rome. Okay, so Charlemagne tries to do that, he fails. And then you have that weird scene, and then the and then the Black Plague, and then comes the printing press, and then the Atlantic phase of civilization and culture, the industrial phase. What are they? What is uh, Shakespeare and them fascinated by? The Middle Ages. <laughs> yes. They're writing plays and culture around stuff that happened before the printing press. So then you get into the 19th century with the Electric Age, and the beginning of telegraph and and the super industrial. The, steamships and all that stuff of uh, the late 19th century, what is the culture obsessed with? They're obsessed with the Renaissance and, and the Shakespeare's and, and all the great writers and painters of the Renaissance period. You see how they're always looking one phase back? Yes. Okay, so then you get into the 20s and 30s and 40s. What is culture obsessed with? They have to be obsessed with the previous phase. The previous phase was mechanization and industrialization, while the present is electric software radio, telephones, and movies. You could even say TV. So what is going to become the content, the fascination of the culture and programs on the, in the radio world, it's going to be the previous mechanical stuff, and that's all the mechanization of the arts, from uh, the constructivists in Russia to uh, Leger and uh, Cubist. They take the industrial world and the, and the organization of industrial mechanical robot cyborgness, yes. like the data did, and they make that into an art form. Hey, probe. <laughs>